Today we're cooking an extremely popular piece of fish that everybody loves today. It's salmon with a little garlic and butter sauce. Don't forget the lemon. It's, it's warming up right now. And we're gonna cook this salmon, this salmon. Mm, I'm stuttering. <laughs> <laughs> I'm studying. There's a lot of S's. Stainless steel, salmon. Anyway, we're gonna cook the salmon and we're gonna put it in the pan. Oh, unless you wanna eat it raw. Today we're cooking salmon and we're cooking salmon on a stainless steel pan. A lot of people hate stainless steel pans. They hate stainless steel pans. And why? Because they stick. The thing about stainless steel pans is that it's a very porous pan, so you wanna let it heat up, then pour oil in there. Cause if not, you put meat in a cold stainless steel pan, it's gonna stick. But you do want a little bit of sticking. You don't want a whole lot, just a little bit, because it's gonna make the fond. You want fond. You wanna use it for your sauces. We're gonna take the salmon, we're gonna cook it, we're gonna put it in the pan, hot pan. I'm gonna let the pan heat up first, then I'm gonna add the oil. Let that warm up just a little bit, and then bang, we're gonna lay the salmon in. Some people like to do skin side down first. I like to do the flesh side down first. I didn't get my tongs, gotta have these. It's a must when you're cooking salmon. Right now my pan should be, it's getting hot. I don't wanna put it in and it's not hot. It's gotta be hot. If I put it in flesh side down, that pan is not where it needs to be, then guess what? It's gonna stick. Listen, I do a little bit of stuttering when I cook, when I cook because one, I'm, thinking about the good food. Two, when I have my hand over a pan, I don't want to get burned. I'm trying to judge the heat without touching it, so don't pay me any attention. The good thing about stainless steel pans also, they heat evenly. You can avoid the hot spots. What do we always do with, oh, the tip I want to give you guys too. When you have your, your salmon, just put a little bit of olive oil on the salmon. Not a whole lot, just a little bit. Give it some fat, that way when you go to cook it, it doesn't stick. But if you don't really know how long you should cook salmon, two to three minutes on each side, almost like you're cooking a piece of chicken or a piece of steak, depending on how thick the fish is. These will probably need, eh, maybe about two minutes on each side, so we're coming up on that time. I'm gonna flip them over. Just a little bit of a basting. The reason why I like to cook it flesh side down, it gives the fish a chance to warm up, and so when you flip it over, the skin is not gonna curl up. Now I'm gonna take, just to add a little bit of olive oil, take the garlic and the shallots, and we're gonna go ahead and start to make a sauce. The garlic and the shallots are a base for the sauce. Once the aromatics start to brown and smell just a little bit, doesn't take long. Then we're gonna glaze the pan with a little wine. Now we take the wooden spoon and we can get all the fun and the protein off the pan. We'll let the wine reduce a little bit, let it get down to a third, then we'll take some cold butter, add that pat of butter into the sauce. It's gonna thicken it up. Now we have our sauce is gonna go on top of the fish and I like to have garlic chunks, shallot chunks, because that all adds texture to the sauce and that's, that's what we're looking for. Chunks of garlic. I'm gonna add a little finishing touch. Just a little bit of lemon, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit to give it some taste. There we go. A little sprinkle of lemon. Add just a little bit of greeny for the garnish. And that's all we're gonna need. That's it, done. So, I would take a bite out of this, but this is for my mother. And if I ate her salmon, she would kill me. We're gonna leave it intact and just like it is because I don't want to have any chunks missing out of my behind. Make sense? So, enjoy cooking. I'm always gonna enjoy eating. We'll do it again real soon.